Hello, this is John from johnstradingcheck.com. I wanted to show you the, our shop and the tools we use to make sure our customers get quality products in the mail when they order from us. So this is our ultrasonic machine. And what it does is it uses pulses, ultrasonic pulses through water, and it knocks dirt off of anything, really. It knocks residue off, it gets in the crevices, it pulls that off. Any dead skin or calcium on a used watch, it'll pull that off. This this machine's used for anything, but I use it for watches. I had a friend that worked in a factory. I had one about uh, probably about the million million size bigger than this. He dipped a uh, PlayStation 3 that didn't work inside of it, dried it off, plugged it in, and it worked. Now, I'm not saying I do that with watches. I just do it with the band and the casing. You know, I never want to, you never want to dip a watch inside water, you know, the movement, because it'll destroy the watch. Um, so this is what it does. If you can see it, I can run it for four, four minutes and 80 seconds. I'm not going to. I'm just going to show you. Yeah, see how the water just kind of moves. There it goes. There it goes. That's what it does. It uses wave after wave of blasting energy to knock, you know, all that nasty stuff off of a wristwatch. Alright, so then after it's cleaned, and that's used water, um, I usually use new water, hot or cold with detergent after the watch is cleaned I bring it on over here and this is my workbench okay I use dry the watch of course I use this this is a sticky dough like substance substance it's called Bergen Radica and it pulls off hair whatever's left on there not not much is left after ultrasonics but I do this anyway this is like a clay like substance that pulls it off. Then I, I'll blow, you know, dust off any type of particles, you know. Um, then I'll polish it. I use all kinds of stuff to polish it, but this is one of the steps. You know, I use uh, a diamond paste, uh, depending on what kind of polish the watch has. Some has like a brush. You know, oil brushed, or you know, some will have like a mirror shine. Um, but I'll polish it with this type of paste. It's a this is a this is a diamond lapping paste, and I'll use that, and it'll get it really, really shiny, or whatever type of polish it may need. Or if it doesn't need a polish, I don't even really mess with it. If it doesn't, um, a lot of stainless it's used for only stainless steel watches. Put it that way. And uh, now whether it be a press on case back or screw back, I have all the stuff for screw back. There's a screw back, Bergen tool right there, screw back. And then you got the, the watch press. Also, um, you, you, you want to make sure when you buy a watch, and it, especially a used watch, that it has a, a new gasket and the gasket's been lubricated like this and you don't have to make sure on my site I do this for every watch but I'm talking about other places you know they just get the watch and then resell it no I get the watch refurbish it make sure it's top quality before I ship it out to my customers and uh, like I said that o-ring and that's very important because when that's not done the o-ring will dry rot and then it'll make water go into your watch and it'll destroy your watch your, your watch will be irreparable after that okay so you know that's very important these are all that's just like the basic steps that we do to ensure you know our customers get top of the quality watches um on our used end we do sell new stuff um but you know there's some g-shock watches up there i do some customizing that's why you see the rit die um, with my custom G-Shock watches, they're all brand new. 
um, I start from scratch with a brand new watch and this is what it what it'll look like when it's done <laughs> see that that's perfect it's a beautiful uh, custom piece right there so um, you know I got a microscope up there that I, I use these are all the tools we, we deliver top of the notch uh, used watches you know we don't just get the watch and then send it out to you. We, we get the watch, work on it, make sure it's top-notch, top quality. Then send it to our customers. After that, if the customer is not happy, they have 14 days from delivery to their doorstep to return the watch for 100% refund. That means the watch must be in route within the 14th day. So you can wait 14 days and then send the watch back. You know, it's, it, it, you know, that's how it works with us. Um, it's not, has to be back to our location within 14 days. It just has to be in route within 14, 14 days. Okay, so, um, you know, thanks for watching this video. And, you know, if you have any questions, email me at john at johnstradingshack.com. Uh, hope to see you. On our site at johnstradingcheck.com, www.johnstradingcheck.com, and all the dot coms. <laughs> I know. Um, I'll leave a link in the bottom of the YouTube video. All right, so you guys have a nice day. Hope to see you. Hope to hear from you. That'd be great. Okay, bye bye.